hey, 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 how's my favorite boss? So please tell me, have you got a Mario game for me? Oh, well, um, actually, sir, um, I'm, I'm, I'm a little bit in a little bit of a dilemma. I, I just, I don't really want to talk about it right now. Oh, go, go on, tell me. Well, okay, I'm just a bit confused about something. You know the original Super Mario Brothers game, and you know how it made us a lot of money, yeah? Well, I think we should make a sequel to this game called The Lost Levels. What do you mean by The Lost Levels? Do you mean like the levels were lost and someone lose them? Like, who lost them? Where were they? Who found them? Did I check the kitchen under the stairs? I don't know, but I do know one thing. The game's going to be a lot harder. How hard is hard? So hard it will only be available in one country. Okay. Which country? How about Japan? Because that's the country we're in right now. So what about the other countries in the world? I mean, the last time I checked, the world had more countries than just Japan. Okay, so you remember that game called Doki Doki Panic? Yeah, that really obscure game that not enough people know about. Yeah, well, I think about turning that into our next Mario game, but obviously changing the characters into like Mario Pacific characters and stuff like that. But I thought, you, at least you just said that the next game is going to be called The Lost Level, so what, what's going on? I'm a bit confused. Well, for every country that is in Japan, it's not. <laughs> well, that's a bit random. I know, right? So what's this new game? New game as in Super Mario Brothers 2, not The Lost Levels. Well, I'm not sure, but I want this game to feature vertical scrolling and picking up enemies, like throwing them and sort of jumping on them. It's just, you know, mixing up the general formula. Whereas Japan, they'll get basically the exact same game, but just remix to get all the tiles and the enemies will be rearranged. Oh, wow, that's different. I know, and you can also choose the character you want to play as. So you can choose Mario, Luigi, Toad, or Princess Toadstool. Wait, did you say Princess Toadstool? Yeah! Mmm, I don't really like that. Why not? I thought she was the damsel in distress. She's been the, the damsel in distress in our previous Mario game. Well, she isn't in this game, because I said so. Okay then, for Japan. Their main villain will be, of course, Bowser. But for everyone else, I'm thinking... I'm kind of in a frog phase at the moment. I can't, I, I can't have animal liking frogs. So why don't we make this a villain that is a frog and he's called Wart and he shoots bubbles at you and tends to harm you? Huh? You hurt me. And you defeat him by force feeding him vegetables that come out of a machine that makes vegetables that is conveniently right next to his throne. What you said that didn't really make that much sense. I mean, if Wart hates vegetables, then why would a machine right next to his throne makes vegetables if he hates it so much. It's kind of counterintuitive. I can just imagine Walt just saying, a machine that makes vegetables? I uh, hate vegetables. You know what? Put it right next to my throne. I think that would be a good idea. And also, who on earth thought that vegetables is a threatening weapon to defeat a frog? It's kind of stupid. Uh, I guess the Princess is in another castle? You make absolutely no sense whatsoever. I don't know who hired you. I know, and also you have this new animal called Birdo that fires eggs at you. Sometimes when you grab a key, this random disembodied face will follow you for no reason whatsoever. It just feels like following you. You are one crazy person. Where did these ideas even come from? Well, I don't know. I had a dream when this happened to me, so I thought this will work as a video game. Quite literally, this entire game is actually just a dream. Oh really? So this game is just a dream now? That's really, that's such a cliche and quite a lazy ending. Like, everybody in the whole world will not be happy about that. Oh, you're too kind, sir. So. so let me get this straight. Japan gets an actual sequel to our best game so far. It's got cool level design, the game is really hard, it's different, Princess Toadstool's a down to one distress, and Bowser is the main villain, and it makes sense. Every other country gets, I, I don't even know what you even describe it, it's just a mess. I know, it's a beautiful mess with colours and rainbows. You serious? Yep. For real? Yes. For real, this is going to be a legitimate game that actual human beings are going to buy. Well, I like it, go on, let's go and release it.